Pokemon. Hey. <laughs> Pokemon <laughs> Emerald. Yeah. Um. We, what's up? Wait. What were you gonna say? <laughs> Sorry, I talked over you. All right. Let's start for no, real. No, we're right. not. No. Keep and it in. And go. Pokemon Emerald. Um, <laughs> we're back. <laughs> Good evening. <laughs> I'm Addison. I'm. He's John. John. <laughs> You got, you got it. There we go. And this is the start of our Pokemon Emerald playthrough. Big fan. Um, we're going to be... Set it? Can you, can you set it to set mode? Oh, you want to do set mode? Yeah, I think we should play a little bit more difficult. I'm really bad at Pokemon, and so I think it would be fun to okay. put it, be a little bit more competitive this set, game. Set mode is the one where... It, what is battle scene? Do you know what that means? Uh, I think battle scene is just like a background. Okay, I'll keep the background. I don't care about that. I don't, I don't, I don't have a strong opinion on it, but yeah, I'll, I'll just, for, just for the visuals, you know? Yeah, the visuals are nice. Um... Yes, that's the one where you have to, you can't swap out after a, a Correct. fight, right? Okay, correct. When I you like that. when you knock out a Pokemon, you can't. You it doesn't can't ask you like, do you want to? Yeah, do you? Yeah, wanna... like they're gonna throw out, you know, uh, Blaziken. Do you want to? Mm -hmm. You know, do you want to throw in a different Pokemon? Right. I feel like that's a little too much preparation. Mm -hmm. Um, and I'm bad at Pokemon, so we should we should okay. make it come. We should make I'm, it interesting. I'm okay at Pokemon. It, you said this was your favorite one, right? Yeah. So I grew up. I I feel like I grew up. And I explicitly remember getting platinum and diamond and pearl for Christmas the year it came out. Mm -hmm. Wait, sorry, pause. What what do you who do you want to be? Do you want to be boy or girl? Um I like the boy trainer, personally. I was gonna say girl, but let's play boy. You wanna rock, paper, scissors for it? Yeah. And then everyone will see it? Yeah. Okay. We're, bo well, we're boy. We're boy. Yeah, we're boy. I won, guys. John we're boy. won. Um, Boys rule! What's All our right. name? That's that's important, and and all these let's plays, everyone's always got a silly name. And everyone everything. always does a silly name. Should we should we silly name it? Yeah, I'll do a fucking silly name. He thinks he's so funny. Guys. Yeah, I'll do a fucking silly name. It perfectly fit. Yeah, yeah. No. Oh my god. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, I'll do a silly name. Yeah. In any event, um, <laughs> yeah. So I explicitly, I I explicitly remember getting. This is in first grade. My parents. This is gonna get a little personal. Okay. My parents had just separated or finalized their divorce or one of the two. Well, so we were TMI. We, I guess. No, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> little a little Addison lore. Yep. Um. So me, my mother, and my my sister were living in a um in a like apartment. Um, a one or a two bedroom apartment. Now, did you like jump out of a truck like this and then go to a new home? When yeah, basically. <laughs> <laughs> You're such an asshole. I'm sorry. Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, that's exactly what happened. I got. I did not. But get is my, that what reminded you of the story? Yeah, exactly. Okay, no, okay. I did not get my own room though. Like mm -hmm. my character in the game, I I had to share a room with my younger sister. Mm -hmm. So. Anyways, we used to, my mom yeah, bought me. You had these big Vigoroth guys helping you move stuff we, around, we too. We did not have big Vigoroths. <laughs> we did have an ant infestation, though. Okay. At that house. <laughs> kind of like Pokemon in a way. Yeah, right? You gotta um, set your clock, right? I didn't realize you had to do that in this game. <laughs> do you have to do that in this game? <laughs> <laughs> He's not responding. <laughs> yeah. Um, in any event, uh, where was I? Fuck you. <laughs> you fucking messed me up. So my parents... I'm the worst Let's Play partner possible. My parents had separated. It was first grade. And I remember, like, my mom used to read us, like, stories before we went to bed. So, like, we had this mini bookshelf. Mm -hmm. One of the books, I think I still have it somewhere. I might be wrong. Was a top 10 Pokemon list in, like, Can I pretend every, to read you a story? Every type. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> read me a story right now. <clears throat> I don't know if a story. Okay. See, I used to piss the bed. You're, <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> right. I did not do that. Um, so anyway, she would read that shit. Like we would read it together, like this top 10 Pokemon list. And mm -hmm. I had a magazine and I talked about this in a previous recording, I think, because I'm a very gullible person. I'm 23. I'm still gullible. Okay. Um, April Fool's is my least favorite holiday. I have endless stories about how I've been fooled on April Fool's. I fucking hate April Fool's. And you know what's funny is a lot of the stories that we have within our friend group are literally just stories about like me like gaslighting you or like yeah all making you believe something that's just not true all the fucking time um so it's that's kind of funny that you just hate that shit <laughs> i can't stand it and i apologize if i ever uh, went too far in no, my antics it's fun with you it's okay, fun with okay. you but like so when i was a kid we had this magazine and the magazine had a fucking it must have been like a rabbit or like a hedgehog or something but it was like very like photoshopped yellow with like red little cheeks and they were like omg a real life pikachu mm. swear to god thought that shit was real for like two years that would be sick bro right um but uh where was i oh so i explicitly remember getting 
Pokemon Platinum, Diamond, Wait, do you name and Pearl. May? Is she just named May no matter what? I think so, yeah. Interesting. I don't remember that. No, I don't think you can name this rival. I think you can name the other rival. I think you name Wally in this game. Interesting. Is that what his name is? What's the kid's name? It's not Wally. He's Pearl and Diamond. Um... Yeah, is Wally in? Yeah, Wally's in Gen Four, right? I don't think there's another rival. I think it's there just, is. There's some fucking bitch boy, dude. Isn't it just May? No, it's some bitch with green hair. That's me. I'm Brand. His name is Brandon. No, it's right? not Brandon. It's a oh, this is guy. important too. Who do we want? I'm always a Mudkip guy. Really? I always go Mudkip. I think Mudkip is the, one of the best Pokemon. Period. Frankly. Well, okay. I um, I. What's funny is I I've gone Mudkip probably the least in my playthroughs. Really? In this game. What do you typically go? I go Torchic, and then I, I I think I enjoy Trico more. Actually, I like the Trico line better than the Torchic line. But Torchic is iconic. Torchic is my least when, but uh, I typically go Trico like second. Okay. So I would say if you go Trico second, we go Trico. I was about to say if any of these were shiny, then we're definitely we would definitely go it, but. None of them are shiny. Oh, do they show you in this little hut here? They do. Yeah, that's why I looked at every single one. They, I've never shiny sh hunted. I've I've never I've done it before, and it sucks. Like it's yeah. it's literally just grinding, especially in these earlier games. My buddy, shiny I'll go hunts. I'll, I'll go Mudkip for you. Oh, because you're Addison. This that's is true. The trainer's name is Addison. We're, I have to go. We're role playing. Yeah, so, I kind of love Zigzagoon. By the way, I think he's kind of cute. <laughs> Zigzagoon is a good a good Rattata. I this. have a yeah, yeah I, I have a pet bunny and and Zigzagoon reminds me of my bunny. I don't know how you got that at all. You just gotta see how she moves and stuff. That's just how I imagine. Zigzagoon would move. Can I ask you, does this game have EXP share? Not like it has like the item EXP share that you have oh, to okay, put awesome. as a held item on the Pokemon. That's but it, fine. Yeah, it doesn't have EXP share like every Pokemon gets shared EXP. We should enable that if what we did, can. Yeah, I don't know. We can't. I mean, we just, need, we just need to find the item. And usually you find like one or two of them total. That sucks. Do we want to do story? Do we want to pay attention to the story? Um, we gotta decide that early on. Fairly bare bones. I think we could just we've all we've both played it enough where we can recap. This is gonna call it John Hub. You didn't do how it's traditionally spelled. Yeah, he's 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 just a fake. Oh, he's a fake. Yeah, John yeah, Hub. yeah. Gotcha. It's like what I would call myself if I were ten. Like if I was a ten year old and I was a fan of John Hub, that's probably what, oh, how, I, how I'd spell true, it. Oh, true. That's know? fair. Don't you think it might be no? No. Oh, don't be no. that way. You should go be should... Mike Child. <laughs> Um, <laughs> where was I? Oh, here it is. I'm finally going to get it out. So it was Christmas of 2008. Okay. And my parents, or 2007, one of the two. And my, my mom, I on Christmas, I remember explicitly opening Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum with a plushie for Dialga. Okay. And Wait, this, where is she? She's uh, in the forest, dude. You're right. That's why you've got the... got to battle her. The Pokemon. No, you don't battle her yet. You have to go. Oh right, you go all the way down and then you yeah. battle her, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and uh, so that was because my, I think my aunts felt bad that like, uh, uh, like that my parents got separated, so they all got me like a, a separate copy of Platinum and Pearl and Diamond. Mm -hmm. I played the game through through three fucking times. Yep. On all, every single copy. Okay. Yeah, that Gen Four is probably my favorite, but Gen Three is my most played. Okay. Sense. And then Gem yeah, 4. Yeah, because when I asked what your favorite was, you said this game. Yeah, Gem, because it's it's a classic. And yeah, it's yeah. really well made, and all the Pokemon are good in this. Like, it's just, it's a really, really well made game. I and agree. even it's for its age, it hasn't, I mean, it hasn't shown its age really at all. Yeah, I think. exactly. I, I think there's something really charming about like, the sprite animations and stuff. This yeah. is definitely, by far, the best Game Boy, Game Boy Advance games are either like the Fire Emblem games or, or, uh, the Pokemon games. You so. know, I haven't played the Fire Emblem on GBA yet. That one I like a lot. It's it's I, that's a lot it's of people's hard favorites. Too. That's a lot of people's favorites. That's um, mm. is that genealogy of the Holy War? Is that um? That's uh, no, it's called uh, something Holy Sword something. I forget what it's called. We should play that on here, but then we should actually pay attention to the story. I'd be down. It's because long too. I like love there, Fire there's Emblem. yeah, there's like different stories for different characters and stuff too. I believe, or there's okay. just like a lot of chapters. I I've, I haven't played it in a while, so I don't I don't actually remember. But gotcha. I'm um, actually playing through Awakening right now. Okay. I, I have you played Engage? I we talked about Engage privately. We have not talked about it on recording. Love yet. me some Engage. Can't bro. fucking stand Engage. Love me some. This lowers accuracy, right? Yeah. Oh, that um, slap's kind of fire too. Yeah, I, I well, I shouldn't say I don't like engage. I can't say I, like I shouldn't fucking. I shouldn't say I can't stand it. Right. My beef with it with engage is that, and we've talked about this privately. I feel like it takes a few steps back from 
excuse me, from Three Houses, uh-huh. what Three Houses does. And a lot of people disagree with me because they don't like Three Houses and the social sim aspects. I like Three Houses social aspects and I like Three okay. Houses uh, setting. I think it's better than Engages. I would agree. But I think that in Three Houses, you can literally just do all Pegasus riders and be fucking busted. In three or in Engage, it feels like you have to do like a more balanced out comp. See, which I like. here's my beef though. I feel like that's not fully doable in Engage due to the class changing mechanic. I feel like it's not as easy to class change. Like... Anna, for example, is designed to be a mage because that's her best stat. Mm-hmm. But she wields an axe initially, and it's kind of a fucking pain in the ass to switch her over to the mage. If you it aren't is. aware that she needs to be equipped with Celica from an early on mm-hmm. time frame. Yeah. Not, no, I agree. I mean, I, that's not. I don't think that's a spoiler for Engage. Yeah. Engage did come out earlier this year. We should keep that in mind. If we that's talk crazy about to me. It really, it really doesn't feel like it. You know, yeah. it, it doesn't feel like it was like a 2013 game. I, I remember playing that 2013. game. 2013. If. 2023. Yeah, 2023. What year is it? Fuck. <laughs> yeah. Um, I mean, dude, well, how was your 2013? My 20... That's what, a very specific happened? question that you might have to... No, I got to research. Go what happened in, in 2013? Time. 2013, I was... I was I a freshman in high school? You were probably in know. like 6th, 7th grade, right? Um, I must have been. Uh, let me look up the games that came out. My freshman Dude, year, Grand Theft Auto th- Five came out in 2013. Yeah, bro, and so crazy. did The Last of Us. So it was a pretty good ass yeah, year. Yeah, that, that is a good year. And Saints Row Four, I didn't play that. Mm. Um, what else did I play? Call of Duty Ghosts. So that was the year that the Xbox One came out. I think. Mm. Um, I think you're right. Yes, yeah. the PS Four. So I was in. PS4 came out 2014, I think. Or maybe yeah, it was it late out, 2013. No, it came out later than the Xbox One. I'm pretty sure about that. Yeah. And uh, so I was in 6th or 7th grade, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Um, That was a good... That was a fine time. I think it was an okay year for me. I think... I have so many memories from, like, my freshman year of high school. And uh, not a lot of them are good, but... I hear that. Uh, was watching a lot of uh, YouTubers and stuff. You know, just... That, w- that was, like, peak me watching YouTube era. What, who did you watch? I watched a lot of Game Grumps. I watched a lot of um, yeah. We've talked let's about play, attacking two cans. If you know attacking, I don't. Two cans, I don't if know, you know attacking two cans. Uh, like Proton John and shit. Proton John. Another another let's play. Like a lot of let's players. I was in my let's play era. I mean, that was a let's play era though. That you know, let's plays don't really exist anymore. To be frank. Yeah, and They're, and the ones that do exist, I feel like are are very few and far between. Like there, there's a let's players like subreddit, and I feel like it's just not a lot. Like I, I haven't really heard of any of the people in there. There's not a lot of big people that I know of in there. Yeah. And then it's just a lot of people asking for advice on like how to make a let's play or whatever. Yeah. Well, we're a dying breed. A lot of people just let's play like a Twitch, like on Twitch, and then cut it up and post it to YouTube. Yeah. Um, like, what do you think of that style too, where they take like a like a six hour vod and then cut it down to like a ten minute? It, it takes me out of it, man. Like, um, like it's good for some people. Some people benefit from that, but then there's other people who are really good at the long form conversation. So yeah. I actually really enjoy watching them for a while. Like, I I like when somebody takes so like Northern Lion is a is a creator I watch a lot. Okay. A uh, big fan of him, and he. He's really good at just talking for like 30 minutes straight, and it's very interesting. Do you want to catch a Poochiana? Yeah. Okay. My Anna is a good Pokemon. Okay. Um, Well, I was going to say, like, for someone like Uber Hacktor Nova, again, shout out, yeah. one of my favorite content creators, period, Um, and and is very influential in my life. Mm-hmm. Um, His stuff is, like, he only does Twitch now, Um, and he cuts it up. He cuts up, like, a, you know, 24-hour VOD. Like, this dude goes crazy on his streams. Right. And uh, releases it into like hour long parts, and I just can't watch them, cause really, yeah, it's too dissegmented for me to like really. It's too cut up and everything and all it. over or, the place. Yeah, unless yeah. really hype stuff is happening, it's almost like you're just jumping from thing to thing. You re- you really need some like epic gamer moments to happen. Yeah, 